O'Reilly. Mm -hmm. Midnight, oh, Midnight Chaos. Chaos. Oh, yeah. Do you have? To, oh, huh? I, I need to check that out. Oh, thanks. You should. Oh, yeah. do you get? <laughs> yeah, do you get video of you getting pulled over too? <laughs> no. Yeah. So no luck on the strut ride socket, whatever the fuck it's called. So now we're in Harbor Freight. Yeah. So right now we're in Harbor Freight looking for this damn socket we can't find. Probably gonna have to get a regular socket and vice grips. Front of these, it's the 17. It's on here. All right, so 100 bucks later, we got a jack, a couple of tools. So now hopefully we can get started, man. What do you think? Oh, I gotta get started on something. <laughs> man, it's been, we've been just fucking driving around for like at least two hours, man. Not, Not doing accomplishing no work. anything. Well, the sun's on our back, it feels great outside. We're gonna try to get this car lowered today. I swear to God, it feels like five hours later. We've been fucking running into all kinds of issues today, but we finally made it to the garage, cars in the garage. So right now we are just uh, setting up this new jack we got. Got a low profile, check it out. Yeah, yeah, removing this plate. Yeah. I guess we gotta loosen up some screws and shit, so. Feel it. I mean, uh, we're gonna skip out on this. We're just gonna fast forward it to one. All right, so next we are going to loosen up the top of the strut. Then as we jack the car, uh, that's going to go ahead and release the tension in the springs. It's close to it. Extreme access, bro. That's the shit we saw online. Yeah, I mean, that's basically what you need. Yeah, this comes out. Yeah, and like it, like all these got holes straight through so you can go through. All right, so we found the tool we need. Hopefully this is gonna work. Cobalt extreme access. So it's an extreme access cobalt. Oh. He's fucking up right now. It's hilarious. Please remove your card. I canceled the transaction. <laughs> All day just to work on one thing. One thing. It's supposed to be, hey, it's gonna take two hours, three hours. Eight hours later, now we're leaving Lowe's. Alright, so this tool that we just bought worked hella good. We was able to put it on here. And then stick the Allen key through the center and loosen those. For right now, we are just taking apart the top of the struts and then we're gonna jack it up. Two fingers in the front, so waiting on the rear. Hopefully we can get that shit done within a week. What up y'all? It's a brand new day. The lower spring install. Heading over to the homie Frankie's house. We're gonna do the rear today and uh go from there, man. So stay tuned. Yeah, so just pulled up, man. Wanna say uh, you know, happy belated to the homie Frank, one half of Midnight Chaos. You know Thanks, what I'm appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we cheers to, cheers. to, to 31. 31. Yeah. You know, getting older, you know, still alive. Hell yeah. Cars and motorcycles and fucking the world ain't killed me yet, so I'm doing all right. Yes, sir.
Perfect. Perfect. So pretty much we got two 17 millimeters here. So we have loosened them and uh, we're gonna try to just take this out without messing with the sway bar length. Good. <laughs> Check that out. Damn. <laughs> it's pressed on. Oh. Ow. No, it is pressed on. <laughs> yeah, it'll come off. There you go. Oh. Oh. Hey, Frank, say what up to the camera. Say what's up, Frank. Say what's up. Hi. <laughs> All right, so remove your stock, pump stock. Throw in the trash. And then for the iBox port lines, you wanna press it down. Press the new uh, dust cover down over the uh, new pump stock. Boom, oh, drop it. Okay. That's how you want the look. Yeah. Want this to be protruding out. Oh my gosh, sir. Yes, sir. And you want the smaller hole to be on top, by the way. Oh, yeah. That way it goes down over your strut. Push down over the collar. And you take the new spring. Yeah, we put yeah, it on now. On right now. Lock it into place like Larry's doing. So basically, you want this to, you know, fit in like that real nice. Coil side at the top for the rears. So the words for the spring will be up and down. So the you know eye box it'll be up and down, real nice. Did you have to order that? Yeah. Yeah. That's a look on your side. You can hit it again. So we got both sides no, on. No, Frank. Got the left side on there. Right side. And the front's already lowered. All right, so we got everything lowered. You know, it took a good two solid weekends. Me and the homie going hard with this shit, but oh, we got, man, the, took got the lower springs on. Let me show y'all what it's looking like. Ooh. Yeah. Damn! <laughs> I'm just so fucking happy because that looks so good, bro. Yeah. Let's see. I mean, you can barely fit two fingers. Now, I do think it's the angle of where we're sitting at on the ground because this side, I think this side is a little... Need some settling to do, but I mean, we're pretty much at two fingers, and you know, 
the fronts are definitely two fingers and that's it as opposed to uh when i first got this car you can stick your whole fucking fist in the wheel gap so definitely excited about this shit man stance is looking really good yeah so again i'm really fucking satisfied with the way ibox sport lines look man they look great you know what i'm saying so what i'm gonna do is let this settle and then i'm gonna get some more shots in about a week just to compare the difference and see you know if it's any different what up y'all so it's been a couple weeks the springs have settled so i'm gonna show y'all um how the fitment is looking with the ibox sport line let's take a look that's the rears looking great you know fitment is looking awesome about the only thing i can say with the sport lines probably want to get the lower control arms when you drop your vehicle it's going to leave you with a lot of negative camber in the rear but i personally don't mind it but just something to think about So yeah, that's what the car looks like with the Sportline springs on. Highly recommend, it's a good option for y'all wanting to drop your vehicle and keep it somewhat stock until you get coilovers or whatever the situation is. So if you fuck with the video, check out our other videos and uh, subscribe. Check out the Instagram, uh, Midnight Chaos LLC. We out. Subscribe, 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 subscribe.